know, she was basically written out of the script when Yoko came along. Mm. You know, and she came home to... They met at art school, they were, you know, young lovers, then they had a child together. People say that John Lennon wouldn't have married her if they hadn't had their child Julian together, whatever the story is on that. But, you know, she was with him for more than half of his life. Yeah. You know, he was obviously killed in his prime. She came home to their house and Yoko Ono was sitting there in her dressing gown, wow. you know, staring into each other's eyes. And Yoko Ono's actually released a statement today saying, I felt proud of how we two women stood firm in the yeah. Beatles family. I mean, that's got a sting, even if they but, manage but, to make but friends. But it's, it's nice that, it that she said it, I mean, isn't it? Yoko's in her 80s now. I've actually interviewed Yoko, and I do think she got a bad rap about, you know, how she broke up the Beatles, a bit like yeah. Zayn Malik's girlfriend's getting now about One Direction. <laughs> um, I should also say I Sarah McCourtney. I remember Patsy Kensett got it with yeah. Oasis yeah, every, There's well, always a woman yeah. that, whose fault it is that these wayward men have decided to this fall This is probably the only time John Lennon and Zayn Malik will be in the same sentence, <laughs> Yeah, I'm really <laughs> sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm not comparing the Beatles to One Direction, but their fans are maybe just as crazy. Yeah. And I should also exactly. say, so Paul McCartney has said, I will always have great memories of our time together.